What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If y'all don't know, my name is Ghost. Truly appreciate everybody for stopping on by the video today. I'm going to be showing you guys how you can successfully exfil with the ray gun schematics as a solo player. I spent quite a bit of time on this, and I think I've got it down to a science now where I can almost get it done every single time. Now, I get it. I should have had this video out earlier today, if not yesterday, but unfortunately, I had to work today, and I saw a bunch of these videos going kind of similar to this one that I'm about to do, and I I was like damn so if you guys can do me a huge huge favor drop a like on this video if you guys enjoy zombies content or if I help you out or if you just enjoy watching the content I greatly greatly do appreciate you guys I'm gonna try to make this short and sweet so in order to get the ray gun schematics which is going to allow you guys to craft your ray gun every 48 hours and be able to start a match right off the bat with the ray gun well there's only one place to find these things and you're going to have to start a bounty contract in the highest threat level zone in the red zone so I'm gonna run through the steps somewhat quickly quickly here I already did a short that's on this but I'm gonna go a little bit more in depth on this one so very first thing you guys are gonna need you're gonna need ten thousand dollars and a fast vehicle so as soon as you start the match go ahead and pull up the map and ping one of the closest vehicles that you have to you at least so you can get around and do your contracts nice and quickly this usually takes roughly about three contracts you can get it done while shooting zombies and everything else you should even out right around ten thousand dollars also the cargo contract is probably one of the better ones that you guys can do because it gives you a pretty strong vehicle that lets you go into the red zone without too many issues as long as you avoid zombies and running into the abomination once you get your ten thousand dollars so go ahead and pull up your map and ping the closest buy station that is in the red zone usually there's only one but sometimes you'll get lucky and there's two drive straight for the buy station and go ahead and buy yourself a juggernaut once you acquire the juggernaut go ahead and pull up your tack map again and ping a bounty contract once you pick up a bounty contract that is in the red zone you're gonna have to see if it is the mega abomination because he's the only one that's going to drop you the schematics for the ray gun if you get another boss go ahead and cancel out the contract and try for a new one or just go ahead and kill that boss if you want to once you acquire the bounty for the mega abomination go ahead and drive straight for him but make sure you don't get too close but be close enough so that way when you throw the juggernaut down you're gonna have enough time in the suit to fully kill him you could get lucky and get this on your very first try or it might take you a few tries but if you do get it and when you do get it my honest advice for you is to haul ass for that exfil because you just acquired one of the absolute rarest items in this game mode once you successfully exfil you'll be able to craft the ray gun in the lobby and start a game with it every 48 hours so that is how you a solo player can kill the abomination and get the schematics for the ray gun no pack of punching weapons no getting perks no outrageously long steps simple fast quick and Marking to the point if you guys did enjoy the video dropping a like on it would honestly mean the world to me and subscribe to the channel man we just hit 6,000 subscribers thank you guys so much you guys mean the absolute world to me i cannot thank you guys enough i hope you enjoy the content there's going to be plenty more to come and i'll catch you guys in the next one later everybody